Such videocy. Originally streamed at twitch.tv slash videocy. Make sure to follow us there, as well as like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff right here. But hey, I don't have to tell you all how to YouTube. And now, on with the show. That's the life of me. Uh, I have no idea what it, this is. Don't think it's the library, but... Oh, are you the library? Uh, there's, there's like... Yeah, I don't know. Not Did you library. just walk up to a woman and ask, are you the library? <laughs> I'm is playing again. Is that your idea of a pickup line? Hey, baby, you the I library. Can, I can push these guys around. Because no, I'd sure like to right check out your books. I'm getting this guy way behind. Great, you're gonna cause okay. a second great disaster. <laughs> now you can go. It's perfect. Now he's walking the wrong way. Now the first great disaster is a, a guy walked the wrong way. McDonald's? Hey, McDonald's! Oh, yeah, that's right. Ooh. No, it's like a new! McDonald's. A new! It? Oh. Walk. Welcome to Walk Donald's. We've been serving healthy gourmet food for over 100 years. My great-grandfather founded this restaurant, which has fast become the best place to dine in all of Genova. He's a real legend in our family. Yeah, I met him. There's another pi picture of the town of the first game. I knew. That's absolutely beautiful. Okay, I'm leaving Walk Donald's. Watermelons. Was there not a building with watermelons? A watermelon's not great. See? Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, why are you in a wash for? Let me through! Never. I'm training! Never. I'll need to build up strength if I want to climb Mount Alpha. That's the only way to become a disciple. Why do you? Why does everyone want to become a disciple? I'm just doing it to get the time stone. Okay, I need the six and fairy stones. I'm not seeing any place with a book on it. Which would signify library. I found the place with the book on it. Look, Kuro, the Imperial Library. I'm not sure what it's like now, but in my day it was known for its many documents. I bet if we go there we'll find out plenty about this time period. They're also likely to have something on the location of the Megaliths. We'll have to find another one to get back home, seeing as the one that got us here was destroyed. But Megaliths are quite rare, and even if we were to find one, how would we activate it? Not to mention it could end up taking us to an entirely new era. Minos, stop being so defeatist! What else can we do besides try? Nothing we can do will change anything. My people, my son, all of them dead. Ah! Kuro, I think Minos is going to need some time to adjust. Let's try finding information as fast as we can. Let's give him time by finding shit fast. <laughs> Key. Piranha plant. Okay, uh, don't mind me, I did not break in here. Oh, I guess I'm gonna talk to you. Even though I just broke in here. Welcome to the Genova Library. I suppose you're the new students. Yes. I am the Dean of the Genova Library. We researchers devote our lives to extremely important matters. For example, finding out why it itches when one is bitten by a mosquito. Oh, we're not concerned with finding a cure or some such nonsense. Knowing why it itches is clearly more interesting. By the by, I will discuss my own research when time permits. I am an expert in the study of the ancient Magi civilization, specifically the legends surrounding their use of the strange powers in late antiquity. But before I can tell you all about that, you'll need to complete your studies. I'm hard to find a joint It's just that, look, Professor, we're in quite a hurry and... Quiet! You are students, and in the library you must submit to your professor's authority. Unless you do not wish to learn anything. In which case, get out! 
Please forgive student Minos, Mr. Dean, sir. We'd be delighted to follow your lessons, in particular the ones about the megaliths. Right, Minos? Yes. Well then, if you're determined, let us begin. You must receive credit for six core disciplines, courses in various fields. To do so, you need only speak to my researcher colleagues in the library. Each of them will submit a problem allowing you to get credit for a particular subject. You can choose your own curriculum. You're under no obligation to do all of them, but I may have a little reward if you complete all eight. Did you get all that? Yes. Spend it. Have fun studying, then come back when you are all done. But no sooner than that. I simply hate being disturbed. He, he reminds me of my old professor. I've always loved studying. It's fun. He seems to know much about the Magi. He will certainly have much to tell us about the Magalus. Okay, the first thing I want to do is I need to find a specific book or something. But these bookshelves don't work apparently. I'm gonna press an A on everything until I find the book. Alright, have you seen a book? I'm looking for a book to steal for some kids. Maybe once we complete everything, we'll get a book. Maybe. Book, 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 okay. book, well. book, 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 book. Oh, hey, man. Hey. Are you by any chance the standing engineer they sent to help me out? Yes. Sure took your time, didn't you? Here's what's up. We gotta replace the town's old piping network. I'm trying like crazy to come up with the best outline for connecting all the junctions, but it's a real brain teaser. Go on, take this map and get working. Okay. You must connect points A and B with a network of pipes. The junctions in green cannot be moved, but must all be connected to the final network. Move the pipes to create a single network that goes through every area of the map. Every area. Oh, this is gonna be fun. I'm not saying it's gonna be difficult, so it might take a little time. Boom! We did it! I took us like an hour. Yeah, it didn't take an hour. Hey, look, it's Phoenix Wright or something. I, it took so long I forgot his voice. Ah, perfect! I was afraid it'd take all day. It did! <laughs> Thanks, man. Just gotta hand the plans over to my assistant when he gets back. Whatever that is, or whenever, you definitely earned your civil engineering credits. Yay. I did it. Okay, next puzzle. Ah, uh, wait. Sorry, no time to chat. Huh, unless you're prepared to lend me a hand? Sure. So, here's the thing. Every 500 years, two comets meet in the heavens. Books on the subject indicate that the next occurrence is this very night. I wouldn't miss this for the world, but unfortunately, I'm... I'm cannot? Figure out what part of the sky they'll be visible in. Here, look on this map. When the two comets arrive, they will cross the map only diagonally. They will not intersect any star present either before or after they meet. Which square will they meet? Okay, so diagonally, so... No, no, probably diagonally, though. A perfect diagonal here. No perfect diagonal there. Yeah, it seems about the only one. Uh, on the two of them? What are you talking about? The two common comets passing through. There's one diagonal, but then there should be another diagonal. I thought they were coming like that way. It, it literally says in which square will they meet. Yeah, but I figured like they're both like oh, like, oh, and then another one. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Here's the other one right here. I'm sorry. It's right here. Yeah, one there, one there. So find the one that those intersect. Uh. Does that even work? You don't want to set that works. Uh, 
Okay. Oh, there's another one. I think. What about here? Does that work? Yeah, and then this uh then me too. Okay. Objection! Of course! How could I miss that? Thank you for your help. Not award you with credits in astronomy. Man. I'm great at school. Greetings, young man. Researcher attached to the militia at your service. Speaking of service, how about you do me one? So, sure. Great, get down. Oh, wait. The Council of Traders has tasked me with implementing a new patrol system for the militia. I've made sure to follow all their instructions, but I'm convinced there's a flaw somewhere. Wait, let me show you. Patrol. After leaving guard room X, each patrol must reach one of the seven watchtowers. Okay. Patrol may go down any path, but must stop with the six tower encounters. Okay. Also, never just the Sorry, the program started running slow. If this is always the procedure, one of the towers will never have a garrison. Which one? One of the towers will never have a garrison. Fuck, I wasn't paying attention. I was making jokes. Three, four, five, six. We can get to DSE. Can we get to D? Yeah. That's E. I think so. Bam. Bam. Ah, yes, of course. I'm in your debt now, so if you ever have a problem, come by and see me. Well, I'm off to start drafting my report to the council. You fully deserve this credit for militiary, mil militiary, military operations. Okay, that was also fine back here. Okay. Militiary position. Are you the new pupil? Yes. I've dug up a strange relic with a mechanism I can't get a handle on. Oh, I'm good. It's doing Do you have a few minutes to spare? Yes. You're too kind. Here, this strange item was found in some ancient Hyrulean... <laughs> Just fucking going for it there, man. Not even... <laughs> not even... Not Hyrulean or anything. Just flat out. Hyrulean. <laughs> there is no lock on it, save for this bizarre keyboard set with symbols. You would do me a great service by opening it. Okay. This chest will open after the 16 buttons are pressed in the right order. The gold button must be triggered last. Which button must be pressed first to unlock the mechanism? The phone must be pressed first. Yeah, oh, the gold button has to be pressed. So two would have to end be the last one. Well, no, that doesn't even work. It can't be just about following the arrows. Yeah, it does all 16 buttons. So it's just like a light, it's just like one of the light puzzles where you have to step on each one. It's, it's the two in the bottom. The two in the bottom, that's one. This one? No, 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 I'm sorry, the bottom right. This one? Hold on, let me double check that. No, hold on, that's wrong, that's wrong, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Try the one above it. Yeah. Damn it. I don't know how you got that answer, honestly. <laughs> yeah. Alright, well, let's check it again. Right, let me see the instructions one more time, see if I missed something. Right, it's just... The buttons are pressed in the right order. The gold button button must be triggered last. Okay. Maybe the number on it and the direction means you go two. You go that many. So the last button would be like the two below the gold but this two below the gold button. You dig what I'm saying? Okay. Just start from the one up here. Oh, okay. M map this out for me. So one. Okay. And one, two. One, two. One, one two. two. 
one, one, two, three, one, one, two, one, two, one, two, three, one, two. Okay. Yeah, so, so try the one up at the top. But the, we didn't press every button. <laughs> we didn't press every button. Shit. Well, then that can't. We missed that beast this week. Oh my god, I have to keep track of every fucking button we press. Ain't there like a piece of paper or something? Yeah, we, I got a notebook. Now that we've been writing down the answers to our randomizer. And okay, hold so on, let me. Talk about. I, I, bear with this. I'm gonna map this out now. Hold on. I'm gonna draw this nice and big so I have plenty of room to make marks. It's not the blood either. My pen seems to be running out of ink. Oh, I'm switching pins. Okay, so pick, so, go ahead, pick one to start on. I mean, if you can do it without my help. It's, it's not these. Okay, so what are we going to next? Just the one, two, three. One, one two. Okay. One, two, three. Okay, you're going too fast. I, 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 have, I can't look at that and look at the paper. By the time I look up, you're on to another key, so. Okay. If you're, I mean, if you're able to just keep up with it, just do it. I think we're on to something here, though. So is this passing them, passing it, to I mean, I honestly don't there. know. Is this is just a theory to so begin with. If it's a passing bit, then I'm pretty sure I passed every button from here. You know, it seems like we could just try every fucking one until we get it right, to be honest with this, you. So just see. Okay, passing it doesn't yeah. count. You actually have to press everyone. So how many of you so how many of you honestly eliminated the whole left side? Yes. Well, that's something. I'm pretty sure it's not this one either, because the, if you start this one, it's only at least this one. If you start this one, it's only at least this one. So? Don't forget about this one either. Well, what are you talking about if you start on this one at least this one? Oh, why don't we work? Why don't we work backwards? So that's got to be fifteen. This one starts from here. Uh huh. And then what? What leads to? What points to that one? Only this three. This one is the one that points to this three. This two points to that one. Now the, the only way to get to that two. Is that two? No idea. And then either, and the only thing that's going to get us straight to that two is the one above it. Okay. So it's got to be the three over there, okay. and then the one below it, okay. and then the two, okay. and the two above it, okay. and the one that points to that, okay. and the three below it, okay. and the two beside it. I don't remember where we started. Two okay. So here? I'm not saying anything else. Yeah. There we go. We did it! See, working backwards is usually a good idea for a maze. We got archaeology rats. Hi, new. Hello, who are you? You're a student! You'll see, optics is as simple as A, B, C. I'll award you credit if you manage to solve a very basic problem. 
I mean, a three-year-old oh, could God, do it's gonna this. Look like a big mathematical equation. You'll see. It's terribly easy. Oh, it's after. Oh, this would be easy. A beam leaves source A and must end up in main conduit B. So I need to get the B crystal. Move the mirrors to direct the beam to point B while activating all six crystals. Wait. Ooh, ooh. Put that one to the left. That, that this one up. It. Put one to the left, right here. Then move this up. I was close. There we go. That's an end to not be on the controller. <laughs> I was close on my paper too, that's why I wanted to just try playing it tactically a little bit. You figured it out? Well, you've earned credits for the optics class. Hey, Pong, I'm playing. Hey, PP. Hello, my friends. It's with a pleasure that I explain you classic painting. You want to learning? Yes. Thank you, my friends. Look, this is not me. I'm literally just reading the text. Painting a classic. To complete the painting, move the color so that no color appears twice on the same line or column. The colors marked with a dot cannot be moved. Okay, so. So it's like a, a 2D Rubik's Cube. Except you don't want the same colors together. Line or column. You flip that green and that purple. Well, well, you could have flipped the green and the purple. That's good. Oh no, no, I'm sorry. Yeah, those can't. You need to get that green out of there because that green can't. Here, may I? I mean, you're welcome to keep looking. Just let me play around with it a little bit. Okay. <laughs> I like this one that hard. Bravissimo! You are a deserving the credits of painting a classica. Oh, it comes bad, I saw that. You one. try to get the other two? Yeah. Oh, that's special. Hello there, I am the new cryptographer for the Council of Traders. They requested that I devise a new encryption system to secure trade. I finally developed a system that's uncrackable. Would you like to put it to the test? Yes. Terrific! If you manage to bypass my system, I will award you credit for cryptography. Cipher. Out of the four symbols, which one completes the series of symbols below? Okay, so we got square, square, dot, broken square, dot. Very broken square with square. And square, square, square. With I mean, literally, it's just a one in four chance. We could just guess each time until we get it right. It's not that one. You no, know, my guess would have been the one on the end. Damn, <laughs> you the same one I twice. I spammed A too much. I just want to get the dialogue. I understand, but be careful. I wish I could press a different button to get the dialogue. I think it's the... My, my first guess would have been the one on the right. Uh, my guess is this one, but I'll do Okay, well, I mean... Like I say, we can only get it wrong three times before we get it right. 
Well, no, because you picked the same one twice, so... <laughs> I guess I'm incorrect in that assessment as well. I guess it's this one. <laughs> okay, wow! We are... We are quit! I, I feel like neither of us are great at this. Well, honestly, I didn't take that much time to study it. Because I, I realized, well, there's only four chances here. We, we're going to get it right soon enough. So it's the square with five dots. Yeah, I don't understand this at all. You have square, square with a dot, broken square with a dot. The dot has the merged into a square while the square is broken. The dot went back in the square, but the square is last broken. And and now a bunch of dots attack the square. I don't understand it at all. You found it, now you have to start again from square one. Leave me. <laughs> oh, game it. oh yes, you have your credits. Well I mean when you gave us multiple choice. <laughs> I didn't really solve it. The library holds so many books it all must be sorted meticulously. I am in charge of the archives, but because such a collection can't be perfectly sorted, I bear the title of an archivist. It's a little joke dating back to the Imperial era. At any rate, I have a tidying related conundrum that has me at my wit's end. I haven't slept for three nights now. Would you like to give it a try? Yes. All right, let's do it. The obsessive sort. One of the books in the library isn't in its place. Can you spot which one? Wow, well, that's it. So, how are they sorted? I'll make those sorted by size, because it seems to be... Yeah, the number of lines on them, maybe? The, the color seems to be fairly random. Fur, 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 fur. Most of these seem to have fur lines on them. All of them seem to have fur lines on them. Okay, what about the number of, no, that seems to, what about the number of lines above and below the square? Maybe one, 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 one. Does that seem different in any of them? Two, one. Oh, two, two. Two, 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 two. Three, three. There's one, the green one on the bottom. No, the other green one. This one? That one, yeah. Yeah, this is the only one that doesn't have three lines on the bottom. Because one, two, three. Hell yeah. We rocked that one. Oh, I skipped the. So be on the side, Sophia. We got you, Par. Par? We got you, Par. We're too cool to say partner, so we abbreviated to Par. I this book in triplicate. Yeah, got a book. 50 ghost stories. Okay, I'm done with school. Oh, oh sorry. So, are your studies progressing well? No. Well, congratulations. You finished all your courses. This calls for an extra reward. Here you go. Yeah, it's especially good at that. What was it? Crypt cryptography? <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't mean... Alright, now on to my teaching. What would you like to know? The Magi. The Magi are a people, or rather a civilization. It peaked more than 2,500 years ago, while the world was largely underwater. According to the legend, they possessed magical powers beyond anything else in history. Some even say they could manipulate time itself. But these are most likely the exaggerated explanations of contemporaneous peoples to account for strange phenomena after the fact. Nevertheless, after dominating the era in which they lived, they completely vanished 2,000 years ago. All they left behind were a few ruins and many unsolved mysteries. What would you like to know? What are commonly called Magalish are in fact the most famous relics of the Magi, civilization. While somewhat rare, they are evenly spread throughout various continents. It is not precisely known what purpose they serve. Deciphered writings refer to a road or path. But where does it lead? Incidentally, it was while searching for a Magalith that my former professor, also a great expert on the Magi, met her end. Quite a sad story, really. 
What would you like to know? Surely it's the greatest riddle ever put forth. Why would a civilization as powerful as the Magi vanish from the face of the earth 2,000 years ago? And without a trace, or practically none, even after years of research, I must admit I haven't the foggiest idea. What would you like to know? My old professor was a leading Magi expert. Her entire life was devoted to figuring out why they had disappeared. I recall she was particularly interested in the Magaliths. She thought the stones contained a power that, once triggered, would enable her to learn more about the Magi. She discovered a Magalith that she believed she could activate with the Stone of Time. Sadly, she was captured by the pirates that lived on the island at the time. No one ever found a trace of her. That was on Magi Isle, the one people now call the Cursed Isle. What would you like to know? Stone of Time. The Stone of Time is quite the legend in itself. It has some connection with the Magalish, but I do not know more than that. The item predates the Magi by many years, so long ago, in fact, no one remembers when or why it was created. I'm not even sure if the stone really exists. The only direct reference I was able to identify is in the archives of the Demonian royal family, which I was lucky enough to visit. The Stone of Time is evidently a large round stone, black, with an eye engraved on its center. Interestingly, the eye resembles that used by the Prophet. A bizarre coincidence if you ask me, but I am hardly concerned with the outside world. What would you like to know? The Magi Isle. The Magi Isle is located far to the east and can only be reached by boat from Sira Harbor. Its name comes from the Magi ruins found there. Pirates made it their home, only to be mysteriously driven out later. Whatever the case may be, fishermen still refuse to set foot there. They believe the island is cursed, and so has its name become Cursed Isle. Quite the ghost story, as if they ever existed. To get to Magi Isle, you'll need a boat. Keep in mind that only a member of the Council of Traders can provide you with a pass of safe conduct. What would you like to know? Nothing at all. Be gone with you then. I do not like to be disturbed. Hey. Alright, thanks for watching. We will video see you. Peace out, y'all. Thanks. Thank you for watching. Now we invite you to do all that good stuff. Comment, subscribe, like. Just letting you know, not trying to be rude. I don't have to tell you how to YouTube. But please tune in for the next show. We'll be back with more video. See before you know. For Maddie and Dylan, etc. At all, we will video see you. Peace out, y'all.